Welcome to this audio blog post of this Swiss French inspired recipe for potato perroche with brie cheese and jam brought to you by Joy Delvita. Ingredients 3 potatoes, medium sized, uncooked. 1 pear, small to medium sized. 100 grams brie cheese, or similar soft cheese, 3 teaspoons of jam of your choice, some butter for frying the roshti, as well as salt and pepper. Instructions First of all, preheat your oven to 200 degrees Celsius. Remove the skins of the potatoes, wash the pear, remove its inner part, and grate both. Make sure you squeeze the grated bits, as you do want your roshti to be crispy, not soggy. Now mix both the pear with the grated potatoes, add each a pinch of salt and pepper, and part the amount into four equally sized parts. Heat up a tablespoon of butter in a pan on medium heat, place the mixed pear potato cakes and jab them flat. You want to make sure the first side is already crispy, before flipping the pear potato roshti on its other side. Push them against the pan again, and cook them until golden brown with a few crispy bits. Once the rushti patties are finished frying in the pan, place them on parchment paper on a baking tray. Cut your breeches in about 0,3 cm thick slices and place them centered on top of the rushti. If you want, you can place a thin slice of ham or smoked ham underneath the soft cheese layer. Position the rushti in the preheated oven and preferably grill them in the grilling mode of your oven, until the cheese is nicely melted. This shouldn't take longer than 5 minutes. Always keep an eye on how brown the edges of the roshti get. Remove the tray from your oven and add about 1 teaspoon of jam per individual roshti, either directly on top of the rushti or separately on a plate. Enjoy your potato pear roshti with brie whilst they are still warm, soft and delicious. Thanks for watching. Read more on joydelavita.com.